Well, you guys know that I'm not a fan of Michael Gove, but he said something in Parliament that needs to be defended. Because that's what we do on this channel. If you say something right, we're crazy. If you say something stupid, we'll call you out. I don't care who you are, what side you are, what color. So, I mean, red and blue color. You know, <laughs> let's not escalate this already. Let's not get demonetized, guys. So, he basically stood up and talked about uh, this this notion of hostile environment that uh, Labour started saying, especially on the Theresa May. Uh, just watch the video, then watch and listen to the meltdown. I'm going to disagree politically and all the rest of it, but I'm just had it up to here with people trying to suggest that this country is not generous. And all this stuff about hostile environment, the hostile environment was invented under a Labour Home Secretary. So can we just chuck it when it comes to the partisan nonsense and get on with delivery? Yeah, that was good. Good, powerful, passionate speech. And he's right. Yeah, because the whole thing is that the Labour side are now basically begging the country to open the uh, do doors to everybody. They want open borders right now, not just uh, for to the Ukrainian refugees, but also everybody who's just waiting on the other side in Calais, waiting for a boat. They just want everyone to come in. And uh, they're saying that oh, the, the British government, our British society is just so nasty. And, you know, they don't want, they don't want, they're not welcoming. And Michael Gove defended the track record of government when it comes to compassion. So he said that the uh, hostile environment started under uh, the, pre um, the Labour um, home, home, home Minister, Home Office Minister. And then some people had a meltdown. Rosie Holt, uh, who is, I think, is a so-called comedian on the left, uh, she came and said, this is very lull. Yeah, sure. Well done, Michael Gove, saying Theresa May was Labour. Ha ha, very good. She wasn't the only one who fell in for this trap. This guy, oh God, the Chief Ramona, Mike, saying Theresa May was actually Labour. Now I've seen it all. So let's do a bit of education for these weirdos who don't understand anything. Because the, the hostile environment, as a, as a phrase, became big again under Theresa May because Labour decided to use it as, as, a, as a political tool and opportunity to spin. And it was actually, it worked up to a point where these idiots still think that Theresa May created hostile environments. No, this is Liam Byrne. He was a Labour MP. He still is a Labour MP. And he was uh, working in the Home Office under the Labour government, new Labour government with uh, Tony Blair and Gordon Brown. He was a of, uh, Home Office minister. He created the concept of hostile environment. This was the report when the, uh, the Home Office uh, launched a drive to seek out illegal migrants at work. This was the Labour government who were doing the whole, we're going to go after the illegals, we're going to basically do a lot of deportations. The same Gordon Brown and Blair and all these other Ramonas who've been attacking Brexit and Brexiteers for wanting stronger borders, they wanted stronger borders apparently back then. So they started, the Home Office started these campaigns, including the idea to have these vans that Theresa May also wanted to go around and say, or we're going to come after you if you are not documented and all that. And part of it is this. Liam Byrne himself said, What we are proposing here will, I think, flush illegal migrants out. Ooh, that's so right-wing. We are trying to create a much more hostile environment in this country if you are here illegally. This is according to Mr. Byrne. Yes, it was a Labour Home Office minister that created the hostile environment. Not Theresa May. Let's tell the truth. Forget about this tribal nonsense. Everybody calm down. Michael Gove did nothing wrong for once. For once. Thanks again for watching. I'm my TC and we are the media.